How about if we have a cast on update from down here in the barn with the sheep? It's cast on for the Curio Stitches knit along. So come along and see what I've done so far. Well, it's cast on day, or officially the day after cast on day, for the Curio Stitches Knit Along. How about if you come along with me down here to the barn and we'll sit with the sheep for a minute and I'll show you my beginnings of the project that I'm working on. And I'll also announce the winner of the um, first prize that I wanted to donate for the Knit Along. So how about you check in with me and see what's happening. I think you can see right here, I don't think you've been introduced to our latest Shetland acquisition, our latest member of the flock, and that is Coriander. And she's a white Shetland ewe. Super friendly, really nice girl. I can't wait to spin some of her fleece. And yes, it is cool enough to need my new Tedan sweater and a hat. So I don't know how well this is going to work. I, I don't. I broke my nice tripod, and so I'm just using a short one, and I don't have a place to really set it. So I fell asleep with my glasses on; they're crooked. But so I'm just going to try to hold up and show you what my start was. Now I'm knitting the Jera Harvest socks, and those are toe-up socks, which is my preferred way to do it. And I will have already showed you the the color of yarn that I'm going to use. And I started out, my, my yarn is somewhere in between what the pattern is written for. It's not a fingering and it's not a DK. It's somewhere in between. So I'm kind of adjusting for that. And as I said, my toe in the first inch or so is going to be my, my um, gauge swatch. And I did that last night. I meant to come on yesterday, Saturday the 24th, and I had some unexpected obligations. And so I didn't get a chance to... Um, visit with you yesterday but late last night I did get up and I did cast on the toe and I've already had to change my numbers and uh, rework it so I'm just going to hold it up and I'm going to hold it in front of my face because I think that's the best way that it'll focus so here's the toe which is in the gray and that's our farm yarn but it is mill spun not not hand spun and I've uh, gone down to 60 stitches. I thought I'd have to do the next size up, but that was too big. So I've got, gone back down to 60 stitches and then we'll go from there. And I had to hand wind the ball of my green yarn that's going to be the main color. And I think you can see that because my daughter has my ball winder. <laughs> so, so that's what I'm going to work on today. It's too wet and windy to work outside today. You see the sheep? Is there anybody back there? There they are. Some of them. And I'll have to insert a picture of the Corridales. So I'm doing some housework, and in between I can get a few rows done on my socks. So I hope if you haven't already that you might consider joining in in the Curio Stitches Knit Along with me and Susan of Wild Cottage Knitting, Wild Cottage Ireland, and with the pattern designer Ellie. And Ellie put out a a really neat podcast last week talking about her designs and highlighting them a little bit so if you haven't already seen that maybe go and check that out it might give you some inspiration and along or along those lines to mention inspiration and patterns you might want to knit uh, Margo is the winner of a pattern gift from me for this first giveaway of the knit along and so Margo I will um, I think you're on Instagram and here on YouTube, so I'll try to contact you both places. Oh, and speaking of Instagram, I did start up a new account. If you hadn't already heard or if you haven't been following me for a while, I got locked out of my old account, which was My Wool Mitten. And just as I was reaching 2,000 subscribers, a milestone for me. And so I've taken some time to decide if I want to try that again or not. And I decided I, I am going to tip... Um, start it back up. So now it is My Wool Mitten Farm, 
and that is on Instagram. So if you haven't already, why don't, if you're on Instagram, go and give me a follow. I'd, I'd really like to see you there. So I hope wherever you are today that you're having a good day, and be sure to check out Ellie and Susan's podcasts and Instagram accounts, because I think Ellie is giving away the next prize. And all three of us have coupon codes for prize, or for patterns, so check that out too. Take care, and if you haven't already, tell me below what you're planning to cast on, or what you already have cast on. Hi, Tamola. Did you come to see what was going on? And there's temperance. To you, lambs. Can we get a picture of you without looking through the bars? Hmm? There we go. First day of a combined flock. Cordales and Shetlands at Serenity Farms. And obviously, I'm waiting on an order of new coats. <laughs> <laughs> so far no drama but they haven't all been in the barn at the same time other than just for a few minutes before I open the door to pasture so I'm not going to anticipate too much trouble they've got a lot of room I'll keep you posted on how it goes can you see the rain coming across the pines Weezer, what are you doing? I figured Naomi would be the pushy one. What do you think, Miss Corey? You're so pretty. Well, they're going to go back out. Okay, it's time to cast on my second toe, or my second sock, now that I've gotten the size that works well for me. So that's what I'll be doing next, after I untangle this yarn. Okay, see you next time.